Well, the John Bear Grease Sled Dog Marathon is the longest sled dog race in the lower 48 states. The race begins this Sunday in Duluth. One dog who will be performing for a former Bemidji resident suffered a series of setbacks that left him totally blind. But the Alaskan Husky refused to sit on the sidelines, and he's living up to his name. Reese Lindquist has the story. Musher Frank Moe has 43 dogs on his property. 28 of them are in training. And none of them are quite like this seven-year-old Alaskan Husky. We are really grateful to have him. And, and Indy became a star almost right away. In fact, he, was, he finished the Bear Grease Marathon when he was two. Fast forward to the summer of 2016, the prodigy lost one of his eyes to a rare disease known as lens luxation, nearly putting his racing career in jeopardy. We still ran him, um, but then he lost the other the sight in the other eye too, and, um, and it took him about a year to get used to being totally blind. Because of his high energy and other heightened senses, sitting the races out wasn't an option. We couldn't just not run him, you know. he. He uh, was very upset, clearly, when the other dogs would take off, you know, for a training run. And despite his visual limitations, Indy is just like any other dog. <laughs> They're more than our pets, you know, they are our teammates. And, and he had such beautiful blue eyes and was such an incredible dog in love to run. And we were just, well, we were personally upset, obviously, but we were really upset for him. After years of training to get him back into the racing flow, including practicing with the older dogs and running in smaller races, Indy is now ready to mush in bear grease again, even without his sight. This year we started training him uh, just like he was going to be one of the marathon racing dogs. And, uh, and he looked great. In fact, he looked... Uh, almost as good as he was as a two-year-old, pretty close. In fact, it, he was one of the best dogs in the team. With a slew of injuries to his sled dog team, Mo decided not to run in the Bear Grease 300. Instead, he and his eight dog team opted for the mid-distance Bear Grease 120, with Indy in the wheel position. He was happy and wagging his tail. He was ready to go again. So for Indy, the dog that almost didn't race again has become an inspiration for dogs of all shapes and sizes affected by the same disease. To know that their dog is going to continue to improve. It's, it's like he was saying, Dad, I'm back. Frank Moe, the musher in that story, is a former state representative who served the Bemidji area from 2005 through 2009. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.